Audio Jungle. Welcome back to Wild Child Records. I hope you just enjoyed. We just had an interview, a dynamic interview with Sil Simone. We had so much to talk about. I think we're going to be doing, we're going to be breaking this up to, into two parts or maybe even three. So again, you're watching Wild Child Records. This show is going to showcase independent artists, main street artists, the story behind the guitar, the story behind the drums, how musicians give back during fundraisers, of course, the sweet sound. And before I let you go, I want to make a super exciting announcement as we're going to be introducing our latest member to our music team, Kay Parker. Kay Parker is a sensation out there. She sings, she plays, she has a direct link to our ability community. So we're very excited to bring on Kay Parker. You're going to be seeing her in up, up, uh, upcoming shows. And actually, we're going to be having her on camera just in a few minutes. So stay tuned. You're watching Wild Child Records. I'm Jay Stoyan. Hi all, this is uh, Mike Kessel. I'm the CEO of Cleveland Clinic Canada. And I wanted to thank uh, Jay and the Disability Channel for all the great work they do. And I know they have a big fundraiser coming up on October 12th this year. I wish them nothing but the best and I'm thrilled to participate in the fundraiser. Thank you all, take care. I'm Zach Damon, host of the Disability Channel Detroit. Please join us at the Disability Channel and watch the Disability Channel Detroit for all your Michigan disability information. Hi there, Wendell Clark. You're watching the Disability Channel showcasing their abilities. All the best. Welcome back to Wild Child Records. I'm your host, Jay Stoy. Now we moved to Studio B as Sil Simone is going into some doing some recording. So we just want to thank Sil. He's such a wealth of entertainment, music, history. He's been in the business for over well over three decades, playing some of the all the major bars in Toronto. He also travels around North America. Right now he's with a, bra a band called Brass Transit, but he's worked with the biggest names in the industry from Tom Cochran, Life is a Highway, to Lee Aaron, to Triumph, and Rick Emmett. So we want to thank Sil. You can check him out, silsimone.com. He's got some wonderful releases. Like I said, we're in our uh, Studio B, and what I want to do now is we want to introduce our latest team member to TDC, uh, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube. She has a, a direct connection to the ability community. I want to introduce uh, Kay Parker to the team. Kay, thanks for joining us today. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so blessed to be here. Beyond grateful. Thank you. We really appreciate it. And we have a strong connection, as I do want to share with our viewers. Kay and Marilyn and Stuart, they played an integral role regarding our successful fundraiser back on October 12th. We had the team out there. They were at the Grand Niagara Golf Club. They helped Stuart with a drone ball drop. So I really want to thank you, Kay, for, for taking the time and volunteering your time and showing your passion for our community. As I say, you have a direct link. So what I'd like to do is introduce you, hand the reins over to Kay, and let you tell us, our viewers, about you, please. Oh my goodness, thank you. So I guess it all started from when I was born. Um, I am adopted. My birth family all has uh, special needs. They're all development delayed and my sister has epilepsy. Um, I was very blessed for the life that I was given when I was um, given up for adoption. And I have such a strong passion and love for my family and the community itself. So I began um, actually working and volunteering at Red Roof Retreat at the age of 12. 
uh, working with special needs children. And that's how I really decided that I knew this was going to be something I wanted to do full time. And just to create the rest of my life um, working with uh, the disability community. And so once I went to school for that, I became a EA. So I work with um, children and adults uh, with special needs of all varieties of whatever the disability may be. I specialize in them all. Um, and I've been doing that for over a decade. So it's been absolutely amazing. And what I've learned just from those experiences of loan has uh, just brought me to where I am today. And I just couldn't be more grateful for everybody yeah. that I've encountered. Well, that's great, Kay. Thank you for sharing. And before we move on, can you tell us maybe a little bit of, I guess, a little bit of soft spot, something that is very memorable with this, with the kids that you teach, like something that you can share that other people don't know. This is going to make me cry, and I don't want to cry on my first interview on air. Yes, um, yes, we we want the Barbara Walters. We want that Barbara <laughs> Walters moment. Please do. Um. Sorry, my animals are just wanting the attention. That's okay. Like we love animals too. Crying. We're all about animals. <laughs> Um, I'm going to have to say one of the most, um, memorable things is that you never know when you're going to be with that, um, student for the last time. Wow. It's, it's a really dark, um, place. So I'm sorry that I'm going to bring this heavy energy, but you asked for it. So yeah. this is it. Um, I've had a lot of my students who passed away a lot of, um, people who I worked for as a personal support worker uh, who have passed away. And it just really, you come to a point where every minute counts. And so many of the disability community members get overlooked and they are so beautiful and so unique and bring so much to the table. And they're so vulnerable and they can teach you so much. And I think the biggest thing that I've taken away is just embracing every single second you have with people. Because that that is an amazing perspective because I've interviewed, I don't know, like lots of people, right? And we always talk about, and I always ask, you know, can you share any inspiration or any moment that you think would be memorable? And I think, like you said, that that's such a heavy topic, but it's real. Like yeah. it, it's it you actually live that. So I really want to thank you for sharing that because that really puts an added perspective on what you do how important you are to the community and how important you are to the people that you're, that you're be, become friends with and you're a teacher and a mentor and a caregiver and, and everything. Right. Yeah. And even with times like these, like with COVID and just the basic common cold and the flu, it's just so important to just realize that you have such an impact and even a simple cold can be detrimental to somebody. And it's just being mindful of your surroundings and your environment and people around you and just being the best person you can be for the community. Well, that makes us so much more happier because <laughs> now we know that you have such a passion, integral part in our community, which yeah. I knew anyways. But thank you for sharing that. And you're just going to be a pillar in an Niagara region for our team, too. So I really want to thank you for no, that. I so appreciate that. So let's move forward now because I do want yeah. people to know what you ha how you're going to be involved. So let me set it up and then you can just build on it. So right now, Kay is hopefully going to be a triple threat for the channel, right? Yes. So, yeah, because she has media savvy. She has camera savvy. She has ability savvy and she has entertainment savvy. So what Kay is going to be doing for the channel now is she's going to be moving in uh, threefold. One as a ability reporter for the Today Show around the Niagara region, Toronto, and down into the USA. So she's going to be keeping our viewers updated about what's going on, whether it's opportunities the channel are providing or opportunities your region is providing, because we're all about helping the people within that community who are disabled or a veteran or able body too. We don't discriminate against anybody. So that's the one. The second is hopefully, hopefully now we're going to be debuting our Your TV Today show, our flagship show out in the Niagara region in the new year. Again, it's still working out the details. We're, you know, we're right, we're going right across from the GTA all the way down to the USA, Windsor, Detroit area, all that Niagara. So 
hopefully when that comes true in the new year, you're going to see a new host called Kay Parker, right? So Kay will be the host of the Today Show, our flagship show, which is showcases news, abilities, our organizations, our friends, our associates, all good, positive stuff. Yeah. And the last but not least is Kay is going to be joining me on our music show called Wild Child Records. So she's either going to be taking over as the host, doing co-hosts, doing segments, doing events, interviews, performing. So why don't we jump right into that? Actually, you know what? Why don't we take a quick commercial break and we're going to come back and you're going to tell us all about your music career and how you're going to be attached to Wild Child Records. All right. <laughs> all right. So stay tuned and we're going to be back in less than two seconds with Wild Child Records. You're watching The Disability Chair. Hi, I'm Anna Maria Faria from Easter Seals, Canada, and I just want to thank Jay and his team at the Disability Channel for inviting us down to learn more about the programs and their services that are being offered. What a great day and what a great opportunity to visit the team. Thank you. Hi, everyone. I am Master Sergeant Retired Anna Maria Bliven and privileged to be the host of Veterans Onward to Prosperity. Each episode brings you more information, sources, and resources by which you can manage your life, live a life, and thrive in your life. So stay tuned to all of our episodes and be the best you you can be. Welcome back to the show. Welcome back to Wild Child Records. We're here with musical sensation, Kay Parker. I love your name, Kay. Thank I love you. that. <laughs> Me too. That's a great name. That's a great name. It's such a, it's a, it's a, it's a, show, it's a showbiz name. It, it is. Like. It's a solid name. It is. It's a showbiz name. So tell us about your uh, music career and tell us how you think you are going to fit into the channel, into the show, into the Wild Child Records. Yeah, sort of but tell so, us about your career yeah yeah it, actually i've i started out as dance and music i did that since i could walk um i was always a strong strong singer and dancer and then i went into community theater and drama and i was always a triple threat that's something that i always wanted to be in terms of the entertainment industry um and the arts and so i did that all through high school I took a break. I did the marriage, the lifestyle, that kind of thing. I raised my babies. And um, just recently, uh, I decided to come back strong. And um, I went on TikTok. I went viral. And I had somebody uh, find me. His name is CJ Allen. And he is associated with The Shot Canada. And he knew right away. He's like, I don't know what I'm going to do with you, but you have such a strong... Um, you have a strong past and I used to record, I used to tour it and like music was my life. And uh, he's like, I just, I need to use you in some way. So he brought me on, uh, we did some pilot episodes uh, for a show that I was gonna be doing. Unfortunately, COVID happened, so it kind of messed everything up, but it brought me to the shot where I was a judge on uh, for two seasons. So tell and, people about this, tell people about the shot. What is the, you know, cause I'm sure yeah, a lot of people, so yeah, this, tell us about the shot. Yeah, the shot, the shot, sorry, is a singer songwriter competition. So we are accepting applications now for our next season uh, for United States and in Canada. We are expanding to the States. And what it is, is just showcasing our songwriters and singers and showing the talent that we have and the ability uh, for songwriters to create um, based on circumstances or occasions and just um, they have challenges every single week, and they're just learning new and new strategies on how to become a better singer-songwriter. And where would, would people be able to go anywhere to find out more about that platform? Yeah, all? so on Instagram, um, you can go to The Shot Canada, or The Shot. Um, we also are streaming all of our seasons on YouTube. Wow. And I know you're very much connected with the Canadian music scene, too. I know in the I past we talked a little bit about that, so... Yeah, so the Canadian music scene um, is super great. Um, like I said, I've been highly invested in music for all of my entire life. 
So coming back to it now, um, I started a show called Trials and Tribulations, and I actually do interview a lot of uh, local Canadian musicians um, and other musicians from the United States and across the globe. And we just want to focus on the talent that we have around us because the world is beautiful with so many successful people. And yeah. Well, tell us a little bit about your show, Trials and Tribulations. Yeah, so Trials and Tribulations is an open conversation where we just like to take all barriers off and just be open and honest. I feel like with social media and the world we have today, it's instant gratification. There is so much um, masking and people are just giving constant highlight reels, but nobody's really talking about the stuff, like the reality of life. So when you're down, when you're having struggles, the trials and tribulations of life and how people get through those times. Um, what strategies do they use? Um, what parts of the community um, help them through those times? And just learning um, through different people. It doesn't matter if you're successful or not. I don't have a criteria who's on my show. I It's an open invitation for anybody who is open to talk about their experiences and that's all it is is just sharing with um people that you're not alone and we're all connected and everybody just needs to feel like they belong and they're understood and they're heard and they're seen and that's really important for me and my platform is just showing people that you're just not alone and no matter what you look like or feel like there is somebody that you can relate to well, that's great because we just want to say that uh, actually Trials and Tribulations is going to be joining our platform. So yeah. be able to watch more of that and connect with Kay and, you know, dialogue and maybe you can go, even go on as a guest if you're a musician. Or like you said, just, you know, anybody to share a positive story. So, yeah, Kay, we're really happy for you joining. So, again, for the show, for Wild Child Records, you're going to be coming on and you're going to be co-hosting or probably hosting, right? And adding your own flavor because you're so knee deep in the music world, right? I'm sure you're gonna have lots of elements, lots of associates, lots of ammo to bring to the show. So so we're so happy that we met, that you uh, have the same vision as us where you wanna help people and you love entertainment, you love music, we love music, we love helping independent artists, mainstream artists. You're gonna be heavily involved in our uh, fundraising platform and expanding the channel to give other people like the people who you're connected to, like myself, and the people on our platform, opportunities for employment within the media world. So I want to really thank you for being on the air today. Well, thank you. Again, if, if people want to find out more about Kay Parker, where can they go, Kay? So all across my platforms, TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, at Kay Parker Official, K-A-Y-E, Parker Official. And that's where you can find me. That's great, Kay. Well, again, I really thank you for being on the show today. And people, you're going to be seeing lots more of Kay across <laughs> our multiple platforms, the Disability Channel. I want to thank Sil Simone. I want to thank our crew. Wonderful show. It's so nice that we were out shooting live footage. I mean, I love doing this, too. This is great because it's, it's very great. convenient. It's a different it's vibe. It's a, it's a different but, vibe. Yeah, the live, you, you can't beat the live, you know, and he had his guitar there and he was playing a little bit for us. So, and we're going to do, do more. We're going to be going right across the city, right across Ontario, visiting studios, visiting mainstream and independent artists and showcasing their talents because we love to support the entertainment world, especially musicians. So again, Kay, I want to thank you for joining us today. You're watching Wild Child Records. I'm Jay Stoyne. We'll see you next time.